Hi, my name is AB. I'm a mammal keeper at the Gladys Porter Zoo, and today I'm going to introduce you to a very unique marsupial that spends most of its time hanging out in the trees, which is the Machis tree kangaroo. This species of tree kangaroo is endemic to the Juan Peninsula in Papua New Guinea, which is located on an island north of Australia. Machis tree kangaroos are solitary animals. Both males and females have non-overlapping home ranges, but a male's range will overlap several females' range for breeding. They can be active at both day and night. Machis tree kangaroos are folivorous, meaning they mainly eat leaves from a variety of plants, but can also supplement this diet with small amounts of fruit and flowers. Female tree kangaroos give birth to one offspring after a gestation period of approximately 44 days. After birth, the fetus-like young called a joey crawls to a teat located inside the mother's pouch where it attaches itself to nurse. The majority of the infant's development occurs during the lactation phase. It will nurse there for about 100 days. After 8 months, it will emerge from its mother's pouch but will continue to return to nurse. During the final phase, the young still nurses but never climbs back into the pouch. By 18 months, the joey leaves its mother and establishes a territory of its own. Sexual maturity is reached within two to two and a half years old. They are hunted by humans for food or trade, but are also suffering habitat loss due to expanding agriculture. It is estimated that there are fewer than 2,500 adult matchy street kangaroos left in the wild, and the population continues to decline. We hope you learned something new today. Thanks for hanging out with us.